A lot of people ask me about the crow pose. It's a challenging and elusive pose, but there are a few fundamental yoga postures that can strengthen and increase the body's flexibility, making the pose more accessible. It was a beautiful day at the beach yesterday, so we took the opportunity to do some filming so I could give you a few awesome tips. As I come out of the crow, I place my hands under my feet so that I can stretch the backs of the wrists, just to remove any pressure that comes from holding the weight of the body. Of most importance is plank, first on the knees and then full plank, lowering to chaturanga. Navasana strengthens the hips as well as the abdomen so that you can hold yourself more easily in the air. Lifting strengthens your upper back and shoulders. From squatting position, lower your heels down gradually. Squatting opens up your hips, making holding the crow pose easier. Arm balances improve the strength of your upper body. It's important that you grip with the fingers so pull them into the floor so you feel the muscles around the wrists engage. The crow pose opens the door to a variety of challenging and fun arm balances that you could put on your to-do list. <laughs> <laughs>